And now the second special feature on our program, the appearance of our second mystery guest, for which the panel must once more blindfold itself. Our blindfolds all in place, panel. Yes. yes. yes Good. Will you enter, mystery challenger, and sign in, please? Once again, panel, back to one question at a time, in turn, moving Usually, clockwise. Does your child know my child? Oh, boy. Yes, she does. Well, then I know who you are. Yes, no, do you? <laughs> well, in, in the past two days, you have picked me up in the rain, given me tea, bought me lunch, and lured me to this hideaway with the intention, I presume, of getting me into bed for what you Americans so charmingly call a quickie. Is that a fair raise you may so far? Why do women always think the worst? Why does sex always have to be the first thing that... Yes. Now, isn't that a touch of class? You know, that's a very fancy name. Brummel. Detective Brummel. What's your first name? Morris. Oh, boy. Super Hanukkah! And what is this music? Neil Diamond, the voice of our people. It's a Christmas song! My God! Oh, my Lord! Did you hang stockings by the chimney with care? Not stockings, Hanukkah socks. Ma, we're running out of candy canes. Not candy canes, peppermint jade. Trading in your family's tradition is not being good at family. I mean, what's next, Santa Claus? I did the thing for the blonde neighbor people. No more! She died loving you, Mr. Charlie. I think you ought to know that. You walked away from a great lady. There's no woman in the world could love a man more than she loved you, Mr. Charlie. She'd have made you happy. She knew how to make people happy. She deserved a better life. You should have given her a better life. I should have given her a better life. Where do I go from here? The Jack and the Beanstalk ride? As a matter of fact, this is almost the end of the line. What do you want me to do? First, Harry, I think I should tell you about the bomb. Would you like to know where it is? Sure! You're holding it. you're getting a star on the Hollywood Walk, Walk of Fame, which is amazing, and it's a lifetime accomplishment that so few people will ever achieve. But, more importantly, do you know how good of an actor you have to be to haunt somebody's marriage for 30 fucking years? <laughs> That's who you are. Give it up for George Segal, ladies and gentlemen. of working with nice people, and I subscribe to that. 